Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Star Sector, the Teardor campaign. Last time, we are continuing with our purge of the Templar, and we took back Fort Operation Base, which leaves the Templar, I believe, with just three cis planets. High Brazil, Antioch, uh, well, Kalan in High Brazil, Ascalon, Antioch, and Stalo in Rama. Uh, we're very close to Antioch, so we might try that first. It's going to be a size six, so I don't think... We're going to have a lot of um, trouble. <laughs> We're getting to real, real difficult places right now. Uh, anything to do here? I think, I think we got everything we wanted, right? We have plenty of supplies, plenty of fuel, plenty of marines. Can't buy any more marines even if I wanted to. Not yet, anyway. So, let's get out of here, then. Let us head over to... Uh, Antioch. Which is weird. We're going, to, we're going after the Templar homeworld now. Because it's theoretically... Theoretically, I'm not sure if it's true, but it's theoretically easier to take than uh, Stalo, because Stalo is a military world. If the Ascalon is not, and then Hybris is over there. Just technically the easiest one to take out of all of them. But we're going to try it out, see what happens. Burn. Active. There you go. Uh, let's just dodge this. No, actually, what is the, the geography of, of Antioch? I don't think I've ever been here before. Hello. Yep, that hits. Oh, good. So it's over here. So it means if we capture um, Ascalon, that should that should end the war with Diablo. Okay. Pause. And then hit nine over there because that should probably put us in somewhere near um, Ascalon. I have no idea what how busy this system is going to be. Very busy. Very busy indeed. Okay. 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 Hang on. So what do we got here? We got one, two, three. Or five crusaders, a paladin, a pope, a paladin, and a, that's not a pope, that's a something or other. Um, archbishop and a cavalier. Okay, it's, it looks like we're moving a little bit here, because then we got them all. We hit every single one of them. Okay, fine. Uh, no, we managed to avoid... No, one... No, we, went, we avoided one of the fleets. They're all, the rest of them are all here. Okay, so. Oh boy. Uh, not you. You. There's 18, unfortunately. It's so close to being useful. Um, someone said I should put the, uh, the, uh, Aspis to defend the Claymore, because technically they're more vulnerable, uh, chip. So, like I said, to be fair, I could do that. And get the get the Pavis in there as well. Hmm. I'm gonna do this. All right, we're gonna have that again. Put you on you. Uh, what's our? Okay, we have a huge weapon. We have advantage, weapon advantage range anyway. But take you there. You go there. Uh, you go pick that up there. Put a capture order on that as well. Right. I'm going to temporarily take control of the, of the uh, Claymore until we manage to fire off its weapons. Temporarily take control of the Claymore until it's fired off the Judgment. Once the Judgment's been fired, we can start to move back to the Victory. The Victory doesn't need to think about a lot of stuff. Uh, I, must, I might nip off to the side and pick up the Nav Boy as well. Nav Boy! Nav Boy! Got a sensor jammer up and running. Com relays up and running. Come on. Grab this nav boy to get some more speed up and running. Okay, we have marchers incoming. Incoming marchers. Okay. Giving a slightly piece of speed. One marcher down. Okay, marcher down as well. That's a set of missiles. Marcher suicide into the... Back away, it's back away. 
a lot of marchers. That's a, that's, 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 okay, that's, that's a lot of marchers. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Um, Jesus. Engage target on you. Uh, okay, let's cancel the, let's cancel the, the, the capture orders. It's, it's less important than just basically having things flying around. Send your fighters out after... Um, S, S is search and destroy. Hang on. This is what? Fighter strike is... S. Okay, so fighter strike these guys. It's silly, but I'm going to fight a strike those guys just to get them out of the way. Also went on hold fire for a second just so I can get my bucks back. Okay, Crusader down. That's good. Ideally, you want to see if I can get. It, I want to get the um, the judgment into the Pope, into the, into the Archbishop. I keep saying Pope because Pope is the. Um... There you go. That's what I want. Go on, go on, go on. Keep, okay, keep the flux high. Keep the flux high in this guy, and get ready to fire the judgment. Never mind. <laughs> get ready to fire the judgment. Never mind. Not required. Uh, Chevalier is probably the next pro next priority target. Um, Chevalier is probably the next priority target. Okay. So let's cut. Let's, let's, go, let's go relatively high um, flux at the moment. So I could actually make that count. Oh, there's two there's Got from behind. Hang on, who's got really high flux? I can hear I can hear a, a, the whining of a high flux longinus failing. So I'm trying to fight like a long longinus without a, a, a high enough flux. Hi Jesuit. There you are. Your shields are down now, buddy. Not let that beam hit. That beam is very, very powerful. Back away for a bit. Back away for a bit. Let's wreck everything else first. Okay, I'm gonna help out. I'm gonna help out the uh, the paragon up and running. If you get because if you get these things killed, it'd be a, a better situation for everyone involved. down. That Crusader's going to die real soon, I think. I hope. Um, incoming Paladin at any point too? Um, right. Start, start turning you guys over this direction. Um, Vent quickly. And, oh god. Two stairs. Shield up. Crusader down, good. Crusader's down, we can focus on this side. Marcher is retreated. Get closer in for the Crusader. Overloaded. Oh, do I want to waste my jug uh, my judgment on that though? It could be mint. It could be amazing. Then again, it could come to nothing. I am very tempted to just fire the judgment now. You know what? Like lock on, uh, lock onto that judgment away. Ah, oh, it came off. Ah, a waste. Uh, it's a waste. We managed to completely eliminate the um, armor off the things. So it just got wrecked by the next missile that came along. Okay, so that's we fired the missiles, so I'm gonna go back to the uh, the victory now. Oh, oh, victory! Where's victory? Victory's over there. My bad. Uh, 
Okay, now you've overloaded all the claw. Uh, you guys are gonna auto fire as well, guys. Come on. Come on. Focus fire on you. Focus fire on you. Come on. Good. Thank you. Uh, hang on, let's think about this now. Um, Chevalier is still up and running. Still one Crusader up and running. Paladin's still got to turn up. Paladin, the Paladin should be turning up soon. Put it this way, the Paladin should be turning up soon. We didn't lose anyone, did we? We lost enough fighters because I was looking at our um, deployment points, and that's, got, that's gone down. turn around and head back this way once I can turn around well Jesuit destroyed martyr disabled maximum drives on for about a second <laughs> a second of a little bit of burst there we haven't won have we no, we haven't won yet Paladin hasn't joined in Paladin doesn't join in what's the point come on Paladin you should have come out first when he had some support I have got no support. Uh, that's taking damage, that's taking damage. We're so far behind that it's not going to make much of a difference anyway. Come on. Bonk. Crusader down. Cavalier's going to go down real soon as well. Think about the Cavalier. The Cavalier, is, the Cavalier could stay at huge range without any problems whatsoever. We've still got, yeah, we've still got, we've still got maximum movement speed. There you go, dead. And the Paladin hasn't turned up. Right? The Paladin did not turn up at this point. Yeah, the Paladin never deployed. It's just retreated. Or did it did it retreat immediately or just did it never deployed? If by looking at it by looking at it CR, I don't think it ever deployed. Uh moving to engage? They're moving for another engagement, so yes, we're moving into engage apparently. Okay, um grab you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys. We have way more more supplies now, so we can actually bring in all combat fleets. You on you, uh, you can go grab that. Put some put some capture orders out. Not that's going to make much of a difference because none of my ships are uh, designed for capturing. The orders are just out there. Welcome to our show, which will deal with wife beating. What? Is the is like the Atle Atle trying to be a uh, Jerry Springer or something or Jeremy Kyle if you live in the UK? That's like that's like the introduction to like a Jeremy to like a Jeremy Kyle show. Welcome to our show. Today we will deal with wife beating. Trevor beats his wife. Calls Trevor on stage. Massive boos from the audience. This is his wife, Sandy. I do. Well, Sandy on stage. Huge applause from the audience. Massive fight on stage. Security comes in. Right? That, that's what that sounds like to me. Uh, hello. My target of choice. Uh, engage order on you. Everyone else can die. A fractal laser. I see. Ooh, hello, Jesuits. You came in a bit close, didn't you? You came closer than you expected to come in. I can tell that like, you weren't you weren't you weren't expecting to be able to be that close. You can kinda tell that the Jesuit wasn't expecting to be there. He kinda dashed in, he's like, oh no, I've gone too far, I've gone too far. You haven't even fired a fractal laser yet. It's just vaguely impressive. There you go, you fired it once. Enjoy. It's 
missiles away! He's trying very hard, bless him. There's only so much you can do. Must remember that this isn't actually the uh, defense fleet. This is just the fleet that was outside. <laughs> you, you also lack like the maneuverability of the. Um... Come on, need some speed. He needs to get into range of the marcher. The marcher can avoid my shots. You can't. Very well. Ah, uh, you're gone now. You're gone now. Uh, someone pointed out, if I fire the judgment, hang on. But if I fire the judgment, I missed it because I wasn't paying attention at all. But if I fire the judgment, it's the biggest missile symbol you'll ever see. Let's fire the judgment, just so you get an idea. So, so I, I had to get it pointed out to me. I wasn't paying attention. That, yeah, I had to point it out to me. Hang on. Do you have anything left? No, we're going we're gonna to win soon, aren't we? Okay, judgment away. Uh, there. Massive missile symbol. It was so big, I didn't see it. I couldn't see the wood for the trees. That is the missile symbol for the judgment. It's huge. Look at that. Massive. Right, the, card, the, the Jesuit is retreated. I mean, that was, that was what was left behind. Um, let him go, let him go. Trip recovery. Um, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna grab you. Then I'm gonna swap you around. I'm gonna, you are gonna be my active, um, my active cavalier now, because the cavalier I actually have is we have pie. I'm gonna actually gonna call the. I'm gonna basically grab you and shove you on the other one, because the other one has D mods, which is more an accurate representation of the one I had before. Secondary refractor laser, good. Uh, another galatine heavy destroyer. That's nice. Shikakis. Find me some Templar cores. Why wasn't I getting Templar cores before? That's weird. More wings. Hooray, Templar cores. I mean, that's that's a lot of money worth of Templar cores. I'm just like, why? Okay. Hit six immediately just to. Not enough cruise keep ships ready. Fine, that's expected. Uh, let me just uh, mothball you. I want to mothball you as well, because you are essentially going to become... We have Pi. Hi, we're going to make you an auto-fit variant there. Yeah, good. Then we're going to go over to you. And I'll auto-fit you as that. Oh, hang on. My mistake. My mistake. I need to strip you. There you go. Strip you. Then you auto-fit you as that. There we go. That's correct, right? Flak cannon, PD laser, crucifix MRM arrays. Which means now we unmothball you. We go in here, we change your name. You're no longer see actually screw it, I'll just scuttle you. Uh I got scuttled. And you are the CSV we have Pi. There we go. We have Pi is actually actually properly a ship that we could have. Um I'm going to move you down, because I, I keep forgetting to do that. There you go, that's better. Um, okay, now we have... A little bit to wait, to be honest. Oh, oh come on, really? Really, you're... You know what, have it your way, buddy. <laughs> have it your way. Do it your way. Uh, what are we going to do? Bring in you. I'm gonna fly. Ooh, no, not all, not all. I'll cancel. No, not yet. deploy, deploy, deploy. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Deploy that. I'm gonna be flying. What's your man? Right. Because what was it? It's one crusader and what? Two Jesuits or something? So 
was it one Crusader, one Jesuit, and one Martyr. What's the situation here? We're gonna have a range advantage. Yes. Yes. They got the comm relays, that's fine. Uh, there you go. Engage orders, just because, you know, have the engage orders ready. I could fire the Arendite, but if I fire the Arendite, all he's going to do is immediately prue and burst, so we're not even going to bother. Who's got, got a couple of Sakakis at the front? I don't want to put those on mine, to be honest. Hang on, if I do this, I should be able to get the extra... Oh, except when you dash out the way. That makes it slightly more inconvenient. Prim and burst, buddy. Prim and burst. Ah, see, so you dash out of it. You dash out of the burst. There you go, Aaron Dot Accelerator. Buddy, don't even. Aaron Dot Accelerator, except no substitutes. That's an amazing weapon. I would totally put it on uh, my flagships if they had. If I had a second one, I might consider putting it on the Victory, to be honest. It's left, it's leaving. See ya, buddy. We took out the Crusader and then used Flea. Uh, we picked up more Templar cores. I have no idea why I wasn't getting them yesterday. That was weird. Okay. We're gonna fly around for a bit. We're gonna have to fly around for a little bit just because I need repairs. I need some repairs, so we're gonna fly around for a while. I'm gonna fly around for a while. Uh. No, we can't. Okay, we're not going to be able to do that because we're going to keep getting attacked. Okay. I might have to fly around in space. In hyperspace for this. Um, okay. Right. You, 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 you. Okay, we're clearly in this corona of a star, which is why we're having problems. Um, right, okay. You on you. I think we've got, yeah, we're fine on range as well, so we're just going to put a capture order out for you. Go there. And you go there. Now I'm going to take control of you, temporarily. Yeah, see, we're forced to see our degrees and reduce peak time. We are, in a, we, are in a, we, are in a, we are in a pulsar beam, which is inconvenient. Very inconvenient for us. Uh, three Crusaders, I think. I guess three Crusaders plus the swords, assorted uh, marches and just Jesuits. I'm looking forward to fighting another paladin to get the uh, get this getting the um. Getting the, uh, put it this way. Oh, oh. Getting a second Iron Dive would probably necessitate severe changes to the victory. Come on. And Jazzy was down. Jazzy was down. Jazzy had fled. Oh dear. That's not good, not good for you, but you just. You, bur you bursted a little bit too early, I think. Up. Does you it down? Okay, so it's yeah, three the three crusaders.
Hello. Come on. It's all the way. Overloaded, but he keeps putting up the uh, the because the Crusaders their sp their ship system is the Aegis system, which is kind of like their version of a fortress shield. I guess. Yeah, uh, we win anyway. It's also a way. Oh. Come on. We're all getting closer now to, to wreck. No scimitars. Scimitars are still very, very good, even versus Templars. Let them go. Ship recovery. No, we're good. Thank you. More Templar. Okay, I'm, I'm going to make bank with these Templar cores. Let's get out of the Pulsar Beam. That was a mistake. Okay. we we'll keep flying around for a little while longer. Sounds like I think six minutes. That was, that's been a very long getting ready for this. Yeah, our repairs are almost completed. Right? And our repairs are pretty much done. What's left, I believe, is pretty much the CR. Oh, that's almost done as well. We have a lot of CR that needs to be put up, unfortunately. So we're going to keep flying around at speed until the CR is ready. At which point we're going to go straight for Ascalon, I think. Because our CR is not going to go... If you start fighting, our CR is going to take a long time to get back up again. So Ascalon is where we want to go with this, I think. Um, okay, we're going to keep going this way because I want to stay ahead of the beam. I want to stay ahead of the beam. Outpost Tiger! They're pushing back, they're pushing back! And that's the hybrid, that's, that's the, wow. Clutch fleet headed for Stalo. Good luck, guys. If you manage to pick it up, I'll be impressed. Come on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna do a, a lap, I'm gonna do, the, do a lap of this. While we're finding all the debris fields and all the derelict ships. Yeah, I think we're pretty much done, right? Yeah, so we're gonna go, I'm just gonna, I'm just heading straight for Ascalon at this point. Straight for, An for Ascalon, yeah. Over there. Okay, pause and F5. Collision division fleet sent to Kalan repulsed, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised at all. Like after I take this place, I might have to pop off and help take out um, Higher Brazil and Outpost Tiger again. Right, in. We're in. Invasion. Cannot possibly succeed. Okay, I need a good 1,200 Marines, maybe. Noted. Well, that, 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 okay, fair enough. That's not happening anytime soon, then. Well, then. Guess we're just hitting nine and getting out of here. God, let me leave, let me leave, let me leave. <gasps> Whew. Oh, there's, and there's a genocider fleet, so we, we found their kill fleets. But yes, I think, uh, because that's currently impossible, I guess we're going to head to High Brazil, and then, um... Outpost Tiger is Asconia, yeah? Yeah, so we're going to do, I picked your Outpost, uh, was Outpost Tiger mine? Good question. Was Outpost Tiger mine? Or that was that in the previous, um... Outpost Tiger... No, Shadow Yards. Okay, but we need, we need to get it back, basically. Okay. I love that nobody mentioned the fact that Ascalon was going to require a thousand plus Marines to take. Ah. <sighs> right. Anyway, I'll catch you guys next time, folks. See you then. Bye.